I'm not sure what else I need to say about Tyrell Terry. Kid plays with confidence. He plays at his own speed. He takes on the challenge every night. Got it! Tyrell Terry puts Stanford up three. Terry, lean in. Oh, how about that? Terry has a three on two. Rising again. Bam! <laughs> Well, this is an exciting time for Tyrell and our program as he's going through the process of the NBA and uh, hoping to get drafted here before too long. Uh, we're going to look back at some of the reasons he's in this position and why he was so good for us at Stanford. But there's a reason he's in this position. And we're going to look at some shooting clips, some passing clips, and also some ball screen reads uh, and what he did at Stanford, why he was successful here, and why we think that's going to translate to the next level. Terry gets his man in the air. Three-pointer is good. Stanford leads. Obviously, shooting right now translates in the NBA. You can send, continue to see uh, in the NBA Finals, uh, the Heat and the Lakers. The theme was the shooting, the shooting, the shooting. With that first shot, you saw great range uh, with, it, with, his, uh, with his shooting ability. Same thing right here. This one's off the move, um, and he's, he has the ability not just to shoot, but shoot in different situations. So that's off the move with range. Again, something that we think translates uh, to the NBA. This one reading the situation, making a jab step, creating space. Uh, and obviously for Ty, one of the things that people talk about is his size, but with this, he creates space with the jab step. That space allows him to get the shot up and getting a clean look from three. One of the things I think is not talked enough about um, as Ty's going into the draft is his passing ability. Uh, through the recruiting process, we thought his passing ability was as good or better than anybody in college basketball. This here, it's not just the vision of knowing what pass to make, but it's the ability to throw it over the defense and then put it into just the perfect spot uh, so that Oscar can catch that and finish the play. This one right here, same thing. This is just something you can't coach. It's just instincts and ability. Ty falling out of bounds after a defensive rebound, three-quarter court pass to get us a layup on the other end. Again, pretty impressive right there. Talk about the vision, but then you also say you have to put it in the exact right spot. That pass against Oregon, he does that. Lucas gets a dunk out of it. This position play right here, again, creates a situation that draws people to him, draws a second defender, and then can deliver the pass on time, on target to Oscar for another dunk right there. So his passing again is something we think is awfully good. Terry, another three, fouled by Pritchard and he hit it! The NBA game and the college game are really moving the pick and roll situations. Ty is elite in these situations and you, to be elite you have to be able to make the right reads, engage the uh, big on a pick and roll situation and then make the right plays out of it. Uses the ball screen right there, gets downhill and again the combination of mid-range jump shots and uh, deep jump shots puts him in an elite category. Call this a drag ball screen. So we're getting in secondary break uh, alignment, but the defense is back. So we give him a ball screen here. Again, creates an advantage right here. His defender is now at his hip. He engages the big. And this is something that a lot of players uh, don't have the ability to do. He's engaged the big, but then really see the other players on the court. So it's not just his man, and it's not just the big. He's watching everybody else as well. As the play evolves, he keeps his head up, sees all his options, ends up getting a dead layup uh, for Jaden there. Transition again into a drag ball screen here. Defense gets caught. Again, the defense in, in uh, certain situations will go under, sometimes they'll go over the top. We've just shown a couple clips where they go over the top and Ty made the right play. This one, they know they can't go under, but the defender hits the screen, which ends up being a situation where Ty realizes uh, just pull from there again with range. All things that we think are translatable to the next level. So for all those reasons, again, the shooting is something that people talk about a ton with Ty. We think that translates because of his range, because of his ability to get shots off in different situations. And then his passing ability, we think, uh, is, is excellent. And as he continues to get used to the NBA game, we think he's going to be an elite passer. And then finally, ball screen situations. In college, he was one of the best, um, you know, with analytics about delivering the plays. Uh, passes at the right time, on, on time, on target. And then his shooting ability off ball screen situ situations as well. All of that, in our opinions, is going to translate, and we're certainly excited for Ty and uh, thankful for everything he did here, but uh, we're going to be watching intently to see how his future unfolds. Terry pulls again. He checked, and he is on. Wow. How much fun is this kid to watch?